Well, for the first time ever, a dinosaur has been found in Missouri. It's also a new geno species never uncovered before. In a Fox 2 exclusive, Vic Faust caught up with the paleontologist responsible at the St. Genevieve Museum Learning Center for this major announcement. Missouri is now dinosaur country. The Show Me State has its first officially recognized dinosaur, and the find is making huge headlines in the paleontology community. Can't imagine anything that's more impressive than what we've discovered here. A new genus and species, that's, that's, a, that's a world famous discovery. This is a look at Parasaurus missouriensis, a 25 to 30 foot long dinosaur that was duck billed. The location of the find is being kept secret until the site can be secured. When paleontologist Guy Giroux found this juvenile dinosaur skeleton, he had it transported to the St. Genevieve Museum Learning Center, the official Missouri Dinosaur Museum. He then called the Chicago Field Museum with the big news. I eventually talked to uh, Pete McAvicki, who's the curator of dinosaurs at the Field Museum, and said that we thought we had dinosaurs, or I, I knew we had dinosaurs. But anyway, he come down and look. And he goes, yeah, you guys got dinosaurs. Not long after, McAvicki and his team were digging in Missouri and found an adult Parasaurus missouriensis right next to the juvenile. Just a, a month ago, they pulled out a, a plaster jacket like this with a big portion of a dinosaur in it that we had to have a backhoe lifted out. It's gigantic. Do we know of it to be anywhere else in America? No, that's the interesting thing. This is, in fact, um, a really remarkable site. Um, in one of the best dinosaur localities east of the Great Plains. McAvicki, a professor in Earth and Environmental Sciences at the University of Minnesota, says he has dug up dinosaurs all over the world. However, he calls the Missouri site one of the most unique. He believes there's a good chance other dinosaurs will be found there, and they have already found massive turtles. We did find a tooth of a Tyrannosaurid. So we know Tyrannosaurus was feeding on these guys because we found that. This find is 80 years in the making. The original owners of the property found bones in the 40s. The bones were sent to the Smithsonian and later confirmed to be that of a dinosaur. But through circumstance, nothing ever developed. The property was purchased in the 70s and digging has been ongoing, eventually leading to this find of Parasaurus missouriensis. The site could be one of the country's most important. Right now we've got plaster jackets going into the hillside. We had to have that hillside excavated back because it keeps going. So we're hoping there's a whole bunch of them and there's what we're hoping. Vic Faust, Fox 2 News.